Hey everybody, Jason here from Ghostbusters News, and this video, it's gonna be, well, <laughs> a little weird. Because while we're gonna be talking about the sometimes mascot of the franchise, Slimer, it's all gonna be centered around his butt. Yeah, an entire video dedicated to Slimer's butt. Stick with me here. Because as you likely already know, Slimer, he is set to make his big screen return in next year's sequel, Ghostbusters Frozen Empire. And given a recent first look at the character design, it is clear that Sony, they are hearkening back to how Slimer looked in that original 1984 comedy. I mean, this is OG Slimer from his disgusting grimace to all those ectoplasmic fat rolls. And as we reported just yesterday, while not officially announced yet by toy manufacturer Hasbro, an entirely new line of action figures based on the upcoming film, they have begun to arrive on store shelves, including an interactive squash and squeeze Slimer that, while clearly made with kids in mind, could be one of the best mass-produced Slimer action figures that we have ever seen. And that's because despite being one of the franchise's most toyetic characters, nearly all past toys of the Class 5 full roaming vapor, they have taken some creative liberties. Either being heavily influenced by the more child-friendly The Real Ghostbusters animated series, or dialing back the grotesque, leaving the disgusting green blob looking, well, anything but disgusting. And for anyone that is a subscriber to Ghostbusters News, by now you know that I've been a pretty loud advocate when it comes to Slimer's original design. In particular, his unsightly butt. Somehow, despite all the endless amounts of gross-out toys in the market aimed at children, this is one area that, for some reason, has nearly always been omitted. Heck, even adult collectibles, from Halloween decorations to life-size replicas, the vast majority of which they provide a rounded posterior, but they stop short, not including any of the gnarly details. Now, I'm not sure if someone in the design team at Hasbro, they've been listening to my and other fans' criticisms, or if Sony has opted to remove Slimer's apparent butt-cheek ban, but in these new, out-of-the-box photos of the Squash and Squeeze Slimer, sent to us by Keymaster Art of the fan franchise group, the Austin Ghostbusters, the green glutton, he is downright hideous. This includes his off-white teeth, yellow eyes, slightly misshapen torso, and best yet, a massive rear end that, in what feels like the cherry on top, includes wrinkles and a big boil. Seriously, this is an official Ghostbusters item. This is a toy directed towards children. And Hasbro, they went all in on it, and I love them for that. If this is just a small sampling of what's to come when it comes to Slimer collectibles, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm all in. But in addition to the toy's overall design, the Squash and Squeeze Slimer, it does have some other features too, like it comes packed with more than 40 sounds, which are activated through interactive play. And by interactive play, I mean you're gonna squash and squeeze Slimer, you know, like the, the actual name of it, it suggests. Now let me also add here, while this Slimer, as well as these brand new Frozen Empire toys, uh, they have been spotted at multiple independent collector shops. Thus far, we've yet to hear of them turning up at any big box retailer. Again, Hasbro, they've yet to even confirm their existence. And if you've been following along with Ghostbusters news, you know that on January 14th, there is going to be a new Ghostbusters toy launch from Hasbro. Is this Slimer going to be part of that launch? I mean, we don't know just yet, likely. But regardless, when the Spud, he is available, uh, yeah, I'm going to buy one, I'm going to pre-order one, whatever I have to do, uh, I, I, I want one of these Slimers. But what I want to know, do you want one of these Slimers? Comment down below, let me know. With that said, that's all I've got for you for this one. As always, subscribe. If you'd like to join up with Ghostbusters news, check out our Patreon page. A link to that is down below in this video's description. And we'll see you right back here next time. Spine, your senses don't deceive you. Call up the guys who are ready to believe you. The numbers five 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 two three six eight. But before you call, let's get something straight. What do you do when the ghost is busted? Is it the source universally trusted? If you got a case of Ghostbusters blues, the cure for sure. Ghostbusters, 
Jason's the guy 